This is a collage from 1991. I've done a zillion collages. They have boxes full of them. And you can see it's like nine inches by five inches. This is this criticism creeping back into the thing again. This is called Brotherhood of Artists. And there's a part right here that goes up. It's from an announcement for a group show. And I would cut off the last names and just use the first names. OK? And I got a bunch of them. They run up into the, that particular series. Uh, and there was a pun in there, you know, that artists are kind of a brotherhood compared to the regular bourgeoisie. You know, I don't know, none of my artist friends are voting for Trump. Uh, there was a kind of brotherhood in the union sense, because there's always the brotherhood of Teamsters, the brotherhood of scenic artists, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, gender included and in, in inclusive in brotherhood. But there was also a little bit of irony uh, in the title and that you heard me say before, I didn't really think that much about community. Uh, so there wasn't any uh, brotherhood. But the effect of criticism, and I use this analogy once in a while, somebody says your art and criticism, writing criticism and your art affect each other. And I say, the art doesn't really affect the criticism, you know? Because you have to be kind of Catholic small c with the criticism to go out there and see things and try to take them on their own terms. On the other hand, when you go into the studio, sometimes it's like there's a little tape recorder in your head playing at very high speed, very high pitch, and very fast. And it goes <laughs> And it's all the other art that you've seen. And you want it to shut off. And Sometimes you can shut it off, sometimes you have difficulty with it. Now, I know that artists go see other art. That's not the point, that you should hole up and not see other art. But there's a difference between seeing it because you want to see it, seeing it because it's a friend of yours, seeing it because you've heard about it show and you might check it out, and seeing about it because there's some sort of journalistic responsibility to cover the waterfront.